Hey there, everyone. Welcome to my channel. My name is Joni, and this is where I'm always trying to inspire and encourage you to create something beautiful for your home. Even if you think you're not creative or you've never picked up a paintbrush, I promise you can do all the things, okay? It's good for your heart, it's good for your soul, and it's definitely good for your mind. So, just remember, it's just paint, okay? So let's have fun with it. Come on, let's see what we're gonna do today. All right. Hello, how are you, everybody? Happy Saturday, okay? And it's a cold one here today in Alabama. All right, so I found another one of these just little inexpensive nativity scene set. What I'm gonna start off doing, so here they are, here's the little pieces, okay? So all I'm doing, I'm gonna start with my DIY paint. So look, we're just gonna take it and you just, just start painting. We're just gonna make it look a little antique, a little, it, it could be shabby chic with just white, but then we can antique it a little bit. So see, it's already looking good, just white. All right, so I'm gonna get my heat gun and just dry it a little bit. See if I can hold it with my paintbrush right there. that stuff. Flying around everywhere. Okay. I think he's dry enough. All right, so I just got it painted. Okay, just I painted Joseph. Okay, just white. It looks good, just white. Okay, because this is how they were all kind of colored like this, you know, which is okay. But I think this, I just love the way this looks. So um, let me just show you real quick. Okay, so here's the clear wax. And the reason I'm clear waxing is because I'm gonna put dark wax on here. All right. Okay, and so this clear wax lets you manipulate whatever you put on there. All right, because you see, he's got a lot of little detail, right? All right, so wait till we get the um, dark wax on there. You're gonna see, uh, here's some dark wax, okay? Again, it's DIY, dark wax, and I'm almost out. Doesn't take much, okay? Doesn't take much at all. Okay, so, look, I'm just gonna start rubbing it on, okay? Just, now this I kind of rub a little bit harder and so that's why you do want this to be pretty good and dry. Just so you won't rub your paint off and that color start coming through. So we'll get your paint dry, but I just want to show you guys. I know this is kind of the freak out factor because, okay, you look and go, oh my gosh, what have I done? I ruined him. No, 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 just keep going. Black looks good too, but this um, this is more antique-ish quite. Just gonna kinda. All right, so let me get a little, um, I like to use a little t-shirt, piece of a t-shirt. Hold on. Okay. And then you just rub back right here. Just start rubbing back. And so the wax, will stay in all those little ridges, those little, uh, the little detail that's on here. So you can wipe him back where he's pretty much white again, but it's gonna look so good because it's just barely in the creases there. It makes it look so good. And so I will just paint the whole little set like this including it comes with a little, this is actually too small to put it on. I usually just put the um, people figurines and then put the little animals down like around it. 
<laughs> All right, guys. I hope you have a great rest of your Saturday, and I will see you real soon. Bye.